Hi, this is Madeline from Sonic Bloom with a brand new episode in the Able Life Insider Tips. And this time I have a tutorial for everyone who either works with an old computer or tends to use a ton of plugins, especially like really CPU heavy plugins like Serum and so on. Um, to, m to make sure that basically you don't have any CPU dropouts or disk overloads when you're exporting your track in the end. And the way to do that is to add an external audio effect to the set. The external audio effect is not part of the light version or the intro version. So you have to have standard or suite for it to work. So I can just simply drop in the external audio effect from the browser under audio effects. And then I'm going to turn off the track because we don't actually want to use it the usual way. We don't want to route audio to an external effect and then back in. All we want is the real time function from it. So you still have to set the audio to and from. It doesn't matter to what because we have the track turned off. We just have to make sure that to and from is set so that the external audio effect is active. Okay, so we really have to make sure that the track is deactivated because otherwise you're routing things in funny ways possibly. And then you can simply export the track. And here you can already see that the project will be rendered at 48,000 Hertz. Render will occur in real time due to rewire or external instrument use. So I'm gonna click export because I just wanna quickly show you and then Press save, and here you can see that it first waits for all the in effects to be quiet. We don't have any on, so we can just skip that. And you can see already that I have a CPU dropout, and now you can just let it run through, and it's real time, you can listen to it, and um, you can see if you have any CPU dropouts or disk overloads. You can even turn auto restart on dropouts on, so if I do that, it'll restart again because we already had one. Okay, well, that's it. I hope you found this helpful. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.